Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of um, The White Elephant in EU4. So uh, last time it's a lot of just teching up and today it's going to be, you know, quite a bit of the same. We just got to, you know, season up land, tech up enough. I mean, we're going to, don't forget that idea group, we're going to go economic and then we're going to get, um, you know, super dev cost reduction, which we should be able to get by the time we want to embrace colonialism. Maybe. Uh, you know, we're doing all this because we want to invade uh, Dai Viet. We're making quite a bit of money off selling them, or selling Ming at Renaissance, so colonialism and printing press will be nice as well. We are, you know, we just beat the rebels down here. There's going to be a few more firing. We have our sort everything out when it goes tits up um, squad. Um, you know, we recently caught all this. We're build, also building workshops all on all around here. You need a proper cheap. I'd even build that. Oh, and be right back. The bell's going off. All right, there we go. Who'd, who'd have sunk it? It's eight o'clock. Um, but yeah, the plan: they dive yet, take take all the land up here, so Ming can't, and then we'll just kind of slowly blob into India when we need it, or into China. I also want to take all of this down here. And uh, also, the wind is open, as you could have heard, might have heard, with the bell. That's because, and you know all of the time I said it was hot in the, in the UK? This time, it's even worse. It's like 30 degrees. Some of you might think that's nothing. Here in the UK, we're melting. We're actually melting. So I've got, you know, a fan. That keeps me warm. Or well, keeps me cool when it happens. But yeah, that's, that's only for proper hot times. Yeah, we are, you know, devving up, getting ready. We should be ready. So I'll um, be right back once we are, I think, once we uh, take Tech 7 in Renaissance. Either that, something interesting happens, or Ming starts doing Ming things. Ooh, we'll just find out, really. I mean, I know we're making a lot of money from Ming, but there's no need to take it that far. There's no need to just give me events that steal away all my money so we're not able to even, you know, support the economy or the troops. So we're just going to have to sit here and hope that these rebels just don't fire. Because even if we were to defund the entire army, they would still just... They, we'd still um, be losing money. So may as well just keep it up and hope Ming is able to repay whatever loan we've, like, you know, we've taken on to repay and get rid of all this corruption. I want it gone. It gets in the way. Nice. Well, that's sixty nine four twenty as well. Oh no. <sighs> Don't worry. I'll have a picture of that in the video, so I can post it on Reddit to get loads of clout. <laughs> oh, it's just it's just to keep me happy. It's funny. Um, but yeah, we're just kind of continuing on. Ming is now only demanding admin points, which does not help us because we need those. To take tech, and we're also going to start losing innovativeness, which is wonderful. But I thought maybe we'd be able to take one more quantity. But you know, it's not that bad, it's not that bad. We're keeping in touch, we're keeping on, um, maybe not on curve to get um, proper dev by um, by the time of colonialism, but definitely by the um, time of printing press. That'll do us good. We're also, I'm also building a lot of, um, you know, workshops, manufacturing and stuff. Not manufacturing, but workshops, all of it because they'll save us at least that little bit more money. I'm not going to convert because we are losing money as it is. We don't want to put more into it. But yeah, it, it's just more and more of the same as people just kind of steal us, try to at least steal our stuff. Which makes, oh there we go, build buildings. Maybe that'll give us, it gives us admin and it gives us a little bit of money. Enough money? No, nope, not enough money. Uh, I just want it gone. But once it's gone, it's not a problem anymore. No, that's all they're demanding. 
we lost we're losing a lot of trust because I ain't sending them my admin points because I need them mill points I, I'll give mill points I just just I just, just don't want to give them admin also what just happened Ooh, Bashan Poor. There's that. Because they are. Anyway, you. Attacker against Yarkan. Ah. So, they just kind of happened to be there while it was like. Ooh, Dive, yeah, there we go. But yeah, it's. You see that and you're like, I want to click it, I want to click it, because I can make it go away. Same with missions. But no, 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 no. Now we just need money. Uh, I can turn you down to save some time while we get rid of all this corruption. And I can turn the army back on. There we go. That's enough for me. Army back on. No problem anymore. <sighs> I, I guess we're going to have to give it to them. Because if we just go too low on trust, they'll just kick us off and we kind of need the protection they give us we're gonna have to it, that's, that's annoying it, it seems like they don't they keep asking for it until you just give it to them and like they know you don't want to give it to them so they'll only ask for that and it's <sighs> painful also employing max level advisors because that gives us, you know, it gives us more points, which keeps us getting, or we get up faster, hopefully. Hopefully. If Ming has anything to say about it, probably not, but, you know. Also, Diviet is invading Champa, and probably going to finish him off. So, that's, um, that's a good opportunity there. We're probably going to get jump in on that one. Still, you know, working on um, seizing land. Oh, they changed it. What is it? Mill points. I'll deal with mill points. Mill points, no problem. Maybe after we got Pike and Shark. <laughs> nah, I will send it to him. I don't know the choice. Just look at them. They're in dip take eight. Is it because I'm sending it to him? They've still not embraced it, so they're fully paying for our, you know, lavish lifestyle. By lavish lifestyle, I mean they're literally the only reason our economy is functioning. Please, Ming, for the love of God, never ever stop sending us money. Like we need, we need so much of their money to um, keep us afloat. Eleven point six. We, but we, without them, we wouldn't have a balance. It'd be negative. But you know, don't tell them that. If you tell them that, they'll they'll stop immediately. We're also, if we weren't a tributary, we would be in fifth main spot, which is a fun thing to think about. And, but we are almost at Renaissance thought, so should be good. So you know how I was talking about um, about the this point in our economy, but don't tell them. Uh oh. I think because they just embraced the institution. Yeah. That's surely not going to be a problem. With a, um, on track Ming. Uh oh. <laughs> I mean, it happens. It happens when you're playing in Asia, doesn't it? When you dev push an institution. Ooh, just good. Just good. There we go. Um, yeah, Ming, we'll get back to you on that one. There you go. Did we unlock any new boys? Nope. So we teched up. And now we're losing money. Ah, but we can tech up in these boys and it'll be fine. We're not quite... You know, we're not quite um, on balanced research. But we're very close. But all the unrest down here has been quelled. That's all that matters. Because we need these boys up here. Because we're gonna go and invade Diviet, who didn't take Champa. They just 
gave up, I guess. It's, it's, it certainly is a choice. But now we need to take money from Diviet. And I think that's all I'm going to take. It's, yeah, because we haven't humiliated a rival. We may as well go in on the Humiliate Rival cast spell it. Call everyone. Nah, don't call everyone in. Because they'll take all money. Right. Once we're ready to invade, we'll be right back. Right, here we go. We got that. We got the new tech with the uh, new ideas. We'll work on them together. Moving our cannons in to get on this fort. We got our navy and blockade range. We're going in for it. We humiliate rival. Get more prestige. And we're going in. Put in ten on each side. But we're not going to call anyone in because then they'll steal our money. And that's not what we're here for. We're here to make as much money out of them as we can possibly rinse them for. And we are ahead of time on Miltech. So we'll breach, why not? They're going up through the top. We're coming through the bottom. And what we want? We want a Humiliate, War Ep, Money. Um, can't force religion. Uh, nah. Nah. What could we get? What could we get that's fun? Give up claims in high attire. There we go. That's a nice 100% or close to as we can get. Well, as close to as I want. Yeah, we'll be back once we can... Ooh, never mind. You boys, you're coming back here to deal with this Diviet army. That's going to be a fun one. Um, Queen Hon. Or... Rather than doing all that, we could get a um, show strength to get a hundred of each point. Mm -hmm. Do I need the money or do I need the points? Um, show strength, when does that end? 15.06. And with my humiliate, money, war rep, claims. Yeah, fifty no six. I kinda want the money re uh... No, we don't need the money. In despite that's what we came for. Show strength. We don't need to humiliate because we're almost out of age of discovery anyway, so it don't really matter. So there we go. Come in here and then there. Six maneuver. Guys going fast. So we haven't got a one a siege person on this, but that don't matter. Not, uh, you go there as well, because you'll be one siege. Here we go. These boys can go up and help with the go up and do more siege. This is a jungle. What are the what are the quality if they did that at the start? No, oh, I don't matter. They're gone now. Uh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Right, there we go. Bunk, 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 bunk. So this should essentially consolidate our victory. They want more mill points. It don't matter. We're ahead of time. Yeah, we're trying to get them. Uh, we're trying to get mill ideas, but we're, you know, we're catching up on that. Also, I noticed we have the corvée system, which is just twenty-five percent manpower. Like, we're going to have so much national manpower modifier. There is it. Uh, do I know my ABC? Yes, I do. National manpower modifier plus 60. 60 plus 25. That is going to be a lot. So 85%. So it's almost double our national manpower. That is very, very nice. Um, Again, we're going to... Was it disease outbreak or something? Looks like it, doesn't it? Right, that's all conversions done. So we can turn that off. There we go. All of it Theravada rather than um, Hindu. That's a war crime if I've ever seen one. Right, there we go. Now we can breach. Ooh, monastic orders of seized power there. A lot of stuff happening around the world. Um. 
and also everyone in Daiviet has just run away into China. Yeah, we'll blame them. Right, I'll be back once we've sieged down the capital, Dongkin. This, this is how strong a heavy ship is. Look how handy that is. You've, you've just tanking it all, so everyone else can shoot. Proper good aim. And we get ships out of it. Our, uh, not even over force limit. That's nice. Very nice of him. So we can just, you know, well, we can just keep all the ships on us. And we can repair in Ming, how good is that? Right, there we go. Can't breach that one because we don't have enough cannons, so I'll send these boys back. But we don't have to. So yeah, we'll be back once we've um, taken Donkin. Ming are seriously taking piss. Like, I know I don't like to swear, but that is just... 44 ducats. That's half our treasury. Also, Diviet. Very nice. And then decided to take out the um, Pretender Rebels. <laughs> there they go. Just wanted, just wanted to share that with everyone because it was beautiful. We still won't accept defeat. But, you know, we can wait. Here we go. And we're in. 99%. And... This is also what I meant when I said, you know, Age of Reformation. Well, Age of Discovery is not landed, lasting long. So we're getting that. Getting the 30 power projection, 100 of each points, and 20 prestige. Here we go. We can now uh, take that idea group. Or idea. These boys will come back, and we're going to have to end the episode. I was pushing it at least a little bit there, but just wanted to finish everything off. So yeah, thank you everyone for watching. I do, I do re- Hmm, coming back on hopes and dreams, eh? I do hope you all repeat, I'll, I'll dock them there. I do hope you um, enjoy watching and I do appreciate it. So um, again, thank you for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.